Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the one and only Wello Show. Yeah, do follow us on our Spotify. It's at Wello. Yes. And today we got a very special guest. Yes. We've been wanting to have her on this podcast. <laughs> oh yes. And finally, we got her. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Iman Fandi. Hey, let's, let's go. go. Hey let's go. Hello, Thanks for having me. Yeah, we're so happy that you came to our podcast. Yeah, yeah I've been seeing you guys all over TikTok, so of course, thank you, you thank to you. make it. <laughs> okay, let's talk about your latest single, lah. Uh, mm-hmm. Top Bob. What's the meaning behind your the song? So I actually wanted. I always wanted an R and B song. Mm-hmm. Oh, okay. So that was the intention of the genre. Mm-hmm. Then talking about the song, I wanted it to mean. Um, You know, someone getting successful. I want I want you to feel like you can succeed, mm-hmm. strength, empowerment, mm-hmm. all of that. And yeah, that's basically the song of Top Up to make mm-hmm. it to the top okay. in the right ways, of course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why I, w- I was listening to the lyrics like a bit questionable. Like, yeah. Some of the okay. Like, okay. Some so of the lyrics, like, so like, the chorus, right? Mm-hmm. Whip, yeah. whip, mm. and then uh, yeah. That <laughs> part of the chorus, everybody's like, "Oh, body shots and all that." Yeah. It's like, yeah. "Oh, yeah, I'm in my whip, whip, mm-hmm. giving full body shots." Means I'm in my car, and you're taking pictures of the car. Ah, mm. yeah. Because I thought it differently. Yeah. But see, but Ken also. That's not my fault. Ken, I mean, it, it depends. Also. It yeah. depends. Yeah. So yeah, it depends. Ken yeah. also. <laughs> so the chorus is like where you're at already. It's mm. kind of weird also that people will think like that. In a way, uh. Yeah. Mm. So that's why I've always had to explain you know, it. <laughs> wordplay, like, I need to wordplay a bit. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Leave it up to their own imagination. Yeah. Exactly. How many times did you explain to people like this? Quite, quite a lot. Quite <laughs> a lot. <laughs> so normally, when you do music, like, where do you get your ideas from? Um. Sometimes it's personal experience. Sometimes it's just storytelling, mm-hmm. or like my song "Love Me a Little More" was a was actually about a friend's mm. experience mm-hmm. about like love and relationships so it comes from a lot of things mm. yeah mm. Mm. Sure. then you do doing modeling as well right mm-hmm. so how do you juggle between these two i think i'm like quite good at time management and i love to keep busy mm-hmm. so that's that's i think how i can juggle it so i just need to teach yeah. <laughs> well, yeah he's the worst at it yeah Time management. Yeah, I just kind of like squeeze everything in, but of course, <laughs> must enjoy your free times and stuff mm. like that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, and music and fashion goes hand in hand because music, you can, you know, you have the music videos and events, mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. fashion plays a part in helping it. So it's fun. So yeah. if I were to ask you to choose between music and modeling, which one would you prefer? I get a lot of this question. It's very yeah. hard for me to choose. Is it? Because fashion is more. Um, you know, being a new character in mm-hmm. a sense, and mm-hmm. then music is more personal, mm-hmm. and they're both me. So mm-hmm. it's very hard to choose. Which one is more easy for you? Easy. Yeah. Mm. Modeling, yeah. I guess so. Yeah, modeling. <laughs> it's just natural, yeah. is it? Yeah. For modeling, I, I guess since I've done it a bit longer. Modeling don't yeah. really need to think actually. Is it? But you need to think what. Yeah, you need to know what, how to walk. Think yeah. to think to pose. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. It's not the easy. But like the vibe. Or like sometimes they say like, oh, can you like be more subtle, be more, or be more to, yeah. edgy, or like yeah. smile more. Then ha- smile, ha- smile ha- more. Well. <laughs> <laughs> different smile, different meaning, you know. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. The smiles and yeah, stuff yeah, like yeah. that. Yeah. But if you guys, you guys would choose which one? Me. Uh. Music. Fashion or, or music. Music. Music, right? Yeah. It's more, more like fun. Yeah. More creative. Yeah, more I feel like expressing feelings. Yeah. yeah, it's, yeah more, exactly. it's more us, right? It's more yeah. personal, right? Like, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Like we get to express ourselves, lah. Like, yeah, you know? yeah, yeah. But Aslam, you modeling or modeling? Modeling. Yeah, yeah, yeah. modeling. Trying to be different, is it? Yeah. <laughs> But no, I cannot make music, yeah. No, I mean like if uh, you would, if you can, oh, if, if I you can, could. Uh. I don't. I think I would still choose modeling. Is it? Yeah. Because you think you're handsome, right? Yeah. The most handsome in the world. Right? <laughs> Music is like journaling to me. That's why I also started it because oh, I, I like to. I used to just like write little melodies here mm-hmm. and there when I was younger, and then I was I would always think of just random things to mm. to write about, and then so slowly I started like, oh, I really like music. And growing up in the house filled with brothers, they all mm-hmm. just played different music, so mm-hmm. I was exposed to that from a very young age. So what type of music like you usually listen to? R and B, pop. Reggaeton, reggaeton, yeah, mm-hmm. Afrobeat, and then sometimes the Hip-hop Lincoln no. part Hip-hop like no. comes in there. Hip hop, yeah, Hip hop, yeah, but not as much as my brothers. Yeah, who's your favorite artist? Hip hop artist or in general? in general? Beyonce, Rihanna, Kendrick uh, Lamar, The Weeknd, yeah, Zara Larson. Who? Oh, Zara, Zara Larson. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. That, that blonde girl. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the blonde girl. <laughs> yeah, you seen the movie The Weeknd? What was the idol? Idol. 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 Not yet. Idol. It's out, right? It's out. Hey, no, HBO, HBO, HBO. No, HBO. I haven't seen it. Have you guys? Uh, I've no. seen 
a few a bit a few eh. minutes then I close. I think oh, the yeah? first episode is out. Okay, yeah, the first episode. Be, the yeah. first, I think the first and second. Uh, if, I'm, if I'm not wrong, lah. Uh, but that show is really damn Why? sexual. Uh. Is it? They have sexual, it, yeah. It's about him, right? Being famous, right? No, no it's, it's about, about the pop star. Yeah. Yes. Which is literally... That him. Oh, it's about her. Yeah, it's, it's about, about her him. making it. And then she meets The Weeknd. Yeah. And they become this like like famous mm-hmm. uh, but the couple. But The Weeknd not bad, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Is it? He can, he can act. Yeah, he right. can act. Yeah. I'm would you, so would you act? If I could, then I wouldn't mind trying. Oh, actually. Like, I don't know how... <laughs> Oh, you but, mean don't know how? But you know, uh, the the lady is Johnny Depp's daughter, right? Yeah, you know. Yeah. By the name, uh. well, she really Lily Rose Depp. Yeah. yeah, she really can act, yeah. Like when I'm I, when I watch her, I'm like, this one is because of her father, yeah. <laughs> <Influence. Yeah. laughs> Influence. And also Jenny from Blank, uh, Blackpink is. Oh yeah, yeah, she's yeah. also inside. Yeah. yeah. Who is she in there? I think she's the, like a friend. Oh, friend, friend. dancer, something. Yeah, like do that. you listen to K-pop? Not Blackpink. not a lot, but I I I know Blackpink. Yeah. Just Only Blackpink. Just because they're so. Yeah. Yeah, they're so, so like big, big yeah. and international. I know like Girls Generation and oh, <laughs> this one song, right? That one. Yeah. But do you know their names not? In Blackpink? Indi- yeah, individual names. Yeah. I think Jisoo, you know. Rose, <laughs> Lisa, Lisa, uh, Jenny. Jenny. Yeah. I only know <laughs> Lisa. <laughs> no, who, who's, who's your favorite? Favorite. Well, I don't listen to them. Oh, okay. Yeah. Who's your mm. favorite? I don't listen to them, but I but I like Lisa. Because she's more like cool, cool, cool girl, dancer. Oh. Actually, I don't know which is which. <laughs> Let I show you. <laughs> Which one is Lisa? Lisa, Lisa is, the, is like the black hair, is it? The dancer. She's oh, half dancing Thailand. Right? What? Yeah, yeah, half, half Thailand. Thailand right? Yeah. Which yeah. one is this? She's like what? pretty. She's the tallest, I think. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The prettiest also for me. I, like, I don't know Sarah, who's the tallest. The one that oh money, you know money. Money, Sadio. The money. song, the song. <laughs> money. <laughs> no, I don't know. Uh, <laughs> <Sadio Mane>. <laughs> 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 okay, let's take a show you picture. Okay, again. Yeah, yeah. Sure, sure. I think you'll I think you'll know which one. Okay. Yeah. Okay, another question that you will I mean I'm assuming you will get this a lot is if you wasn't doing modeling or doing music, mm-hmm. what would you do? What do you so, think you would do? I think it was if it was out of the entertainment industry, it'll be psychology. Like helping oh, yeah. kids, uh social you work, maybe a little bit. Yeah. Oh. So so I have a degree in psychology and Shit. <laughs> That's why like, every time when people say they study psychology, I feel like they can read our minds. Is it no, true? Or no, no, cannot, no. Right? Technically, it's right? not like that. But right. we do study like body language yeah, yeah, yeah. and stuff like that. You can yeah. technically okay. read the mind as well. Body language, yeah. <laughs> body language. I cannot. I I cannot think about. I don't uh, know what you're. What about uh, Loki? Like, right, that's why she comes in. She read all the body language. That's why right. now also actually. <laughs> no, 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 like no, she no, knows no. Uh, <laughs> body language. <laughs> <laughs> I really like uh, nothing. Uh, okay, uh. <laughs> <laughs> Scary. <laughs> yeah, so it'll, it'll either be like working with kids mm-hmm. or something in psychology. Yeah. But is it, is it hard, no? psychology? Studying psychology? Yeah, the brain part is hard. Is it? Yeah, because I, I, I hate I always, science. Oh. I always somehow like get a little bit intimidated if people study psychology. Why? Because of what I could say just now. But it's, not true. but it's not true, but it's just at mm. the back of my mind, I would yeah. always think that. Like you're, you're cautious with yeah. it. But it's not. It's not. Yeah. Chill, bro. Yeah, you can put your legs back like that. It's not. Ah, Chill. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> but can you can you share us a little bit about your childhood, like how was growing up, like? Hmm. So what do you want to know? Everything. Oh. <laughs> okay. So I used to live in Indonesia for oh, four it? years. Okay. Yeah, okay. and then I came back here to Singapore when I was about eleven, and I went to like primary school, mm. secondary school. My secondary school was um, Singapore Sports School, mm-hmm. so I did track mm-hmm. and field there. And then I actually left in sec two and then I went to a different secondary school because track was just not my thing at, uh, anymore. Mm. But growing up, like family wise, it's fun, mm-hmm. but hard because mm. when I when I used to live in Jakarta, nobody knew, like, mm. you know, my family and stuff. Mm. And I also didn't know actually what what my dad did, what mm. my mom did. But when we moved Don't back really to fully Singapore, understand that. yeah, I didn't understand mm. But when we moved back and I went to school slowly, like friends would come up to me and be like, oh, can I be your friend? I guess. Mm-hmm. Would be like, oh, can I come up to you? Uh, can I become your friend? Let's mm-hmm. hang out. And I'll be like, yeah, mm-hmm. you know. Mm-hmm. But then slowly, I think I started to realize like, oh, their intentions might be different yeah. and all yeah. that. Because I actually Googled my family <laughs> when I was younger. I was like, why? Why, mm-hmm. why when I go out, people are taking pictures? Mm-hmm. You know, so I started to understand. And... Being, I guess, also um, in the eye of the world, yeah. mm. if that makes sense, yeah. um, 
it, there's a lot of criti- criticism. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Opinions are open, yeah. you yeah. know. And then also working at a young age, social media in our generation, there's uh, it can be hard just because like. As a young child, you just see all the hate comments. You yeah. don't think about the positives. Yeah. So those were the hard times for me, I would say. But my what, family's what, what pretty chill. That, so. What do you think that we always focus on the hate comments? Why? Hmm. I think it's because we, well, for me at that time, I thought, why, why don't they like me? Like I, I'm doing what I do. Mm-hmm. I'm being who I am. Mm-hmm. Why is that a problem? Mm-hmm. So I think that was why I was like. But why? I, I just want everybody to like me. But, <laughs> you know, when you grow up, you just realize not everybody's going to like mm, you. Not yeah. everybody's going to like what you do. Mm. And you cannot you cannot control other people's opinions as well. Mm. Yeah. Mm. So I had to learn, like, how to do that from about 13, 14, how to just navigate. And also, I don't know if you remember, Twitter had this, like, Ask FM thing. Ask FM, yeah, yeah, Ask yeah, yeah, FM. Yeah, yeah. And it was just anonymous people. Yeah. That was where it oh, all, the, like, started. Oh, yeah. was it? Damn. Twitter was like the hectic, like, <laughs> I was so scared of Twitter. No, no, it's like the NGL thing, right? Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. On Instagram? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh. No, but the Us FM is Twitter, I think. Or mm-hmm. maybe Instagram also have. No, I don't think so. Not was not it? anymore. Oh, yeah. It wasn't yeah, yeah. as, like, big as last time. Mm. So, yeah. So. But your support system from your family is good, right? Strong, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. For sure. Because I'm, I'm sure my brothers and, you know, my, my parents also feel a type of pressure. Mm, mm, mm. And I think... As a child of Fandi Ahmad also, mm-hmm. I always think, oh no, I have to meet like their standards mm. in the eye of people. I have to also um, be as big as my dad mm. or, you know, I think I must always prove something. Yeah. But yeah, I mean, whatever I do, I still need to do it for me mm-hmm. and what I, I love doing and mm. just try new things. I'm quite adventurous and I like to experiment. So, What's the newest thing that you tried? Um... Well, I went bungee jumping. Oh, is it? And then I, yeah, Sentosa. yeah, Damn. it was scary. I will and never. then, and oh, the music wow. is like the the big thing. Oh, uh, yeah, music would be the big thing. What is something that you want to do? I want to try acting. Acting, oh. thing, huh? yeah. But also, like, I'm I'm scared. But if the opportunity comes, I think you should just like go mm. for it. Because I always think try it, and then once you know if it works or not, mm. then. You know, there you go. That's your answer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Take the risk. If not, yeah, exactly. then you're going to live with regret. Yeah, I don't think many people would just want to try it out. Because mm-hmm. they're, they're scared. Yeah. But if not, then you're just going to keep thinking about it. And if you yeah. try it, at least you can say, oh, I tried this. I tried that. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I think many people are just afraid. But mm-hmm. what would you say to them? Like, to make them try? Like, take the risk. Just that. Just take the risk. Try it. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. That one or that yeah, one? That one. Side. That one. Straight take there. the risk. Try what you want to. And of course... Like have a great support system and have your friends there. Mm, yeah. that's cool. Solid words. The support system is very important. Right? Of course, yeah. But I think some people, like myself, we don't know like if we can tell people things. Like we don't mm. want to burden them. I don't yeah. know if you felt that before. Uh, yeah. like, like to your family or what? Yeah, yeah to family, to friends. Like I don't know if you think like, oh no, I have this problem, but I don't want to mm-hmm. share it. Maybe mm-hmm. I can solve it myself. Because mm-hmm. that I'm, well, you want I'm to that try kind to of solve person. It first. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. I'm that kind of person. Mm-hmm. But sometimes you don't know where, when is the limit to should I mm-hmm. tell now or like should mm-hmm. I just wait a little longer so I can settle it? Like you don't yeah. know the yeah. time. <laughs> but I feel like yeah, at the end of the day, if you really cannot, you have to ask for help, lah. You know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm-hmm. Ask for a child help you can. Ask, ask anything I will ask him uh, for ask help. me just ask me yeah. <laughs> uh, I want to ask you like, how is it like growing up with four or five boys is it? four four, four brothers four. two four older and two younger mm. yeah uh, so it's will fun con- will you consider yourself like a bit tomboy yeah tomboyish I used to be more tomboyish yeah mm. <laughs> Used to be more, but I'm. I, I would say I'm still tomboy a little bit here and there. I still love to like you know, um, play yeah, yeah, play yeah. football or whatever <laughs> it is. I'm open, yeah. But it was fun. Of course, when I was younger, I would be like bullied a little bit, but not like in the bad way. It's oh, more yeah, like yeah, it's yeah, more yeah, like I fun that. and all that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I remember just playing like Nerf guns and this one. Oh, oh, a lot of boy stuff. Yeah, I was surrounded <laughs> with. Yeah, but I. I Remember, I always wished, oh, like, what if I had an older sister? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Older, not younger. I don't know oh. why. Huh? But older. Well, a big sister. Yeah. What? To look up to. Oh. Sister. Yeah. So that if if anything, then you I have go- a guide. Uh-uh. Yeah. 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 But yeah. I guess my mom is that. Yeah yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 But it's different. Mom and yeah, I. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yeah. Exactly. But do you have like that middle child syndrome? Because I'm the only girl, I don't feel it princess. as much. Oh, it's different princess, now, so yeah. princess statement, not not middle oh, yeah. child, princess <laughs> statement. <this one. laughs> but only when my brothers got older, then I felt 
how protective they can be. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. When I was younger, I didn't really feel it. Listen, uh-huh. Yeah, and my dad also. <laughs> I feel it now. Yeah. Wait, <laughs> yeah. it's a girl. You, you're the middle, middle child. Middle lah, mm-hmm. too mm-hmm. older, too younger. Right? Middle lah, eh, mad too. It's like you can get away with stuff, but you cannot really get away with stuff. Mm. Yeah. Who's your favorite? Favorite what? Oh, my brothers. Oof. Oof. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Must I do. have different brothers for different situations. Okay. Yeah. But the person I'm closer to right now is the youngest one Irian mm. oh yeah, yeah. yeah he's, he's 16 taller this, eh? yeah he's ta- everybody's taller than me now <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm like the small one <laughs> <laughs> okay uh, okay last few questions uh. yeah uh, what is your best fan experience best fan fan, fan experience ooh like the most like hey, wow. um, I guess when I go to events mm. and like the fans notice me mm-hmm. and they you know ask for my pictures and stuff so it's happened where some of them message me and dm me saying like oh i saw you thank you so much for like everything you've done things mm-hmm. like that mm-hmm. those mean a lot to me or like when i started music um some fans would tell me thanks for you know pushing me to mm-hmm. do something that i've never done before mm-hmm. so it's it wouldn't be one person mm-hmm. it would be kind of the things that they would say or do mm-hmm. yeah so That would be the best, I would say, mm. if I could inspire people. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. That. Yeah. Okay, who's your biggest inspiration? Mm. Rihanna and Zendaya. Ooh. I love Zendaya. Why? It's just that she she's doing a lot of things. She does music. She dances. Oh, she's she acts. acting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. You watch and, Euphoria. Yeah, yeah, mm. and I think like <laughs> she's just great, a great role model. Ooh. Yeah. Who's your in- inspiration? Ah, uh, Kanye West. Really? Yeah. Oh. Why? She don't oh, like Kanye. Me, yeah, that's why. <laughs> she don't like Kanye. <laughs> no, no, no. no. <laughs> watch, I like I like his music. You watch uh, his documentary? No, yeah. I didn't watch the documentary. Oh my god, you should. Watch. Yeah, you should watch. Is it new? Really? No, no, uh, no, it's not. This year, right? Huh? No. Or last year? I don't know, but it's like not this year, I think. I think last year, but Maybe. quite recent, lah. With his like music and fashion, all like that. How, yeah, it? yeah. How he? He actually right. He he record himself before he even famous. Like he believe himself that much. Yeah. No, yeah. he's <laughs> very like passionate and very motivated. I feel. The way he speaks, also, yeah. it's yeah, like yeah, yeah. he knows he's gonna get there. Yeah. Exactly, it's inspiring. He's crazy, and yeah. not but not a lot of people can do that. Like yeah, have exactly. that confidence in them. Yeah. I think people need his that. What's it called? Mental, ego. But that's the ego. thing. If you do it too much, some people say, "Oh, you're 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 like egotistic." Yeah, yeah, yeah or like yeah. you're too in your own head. Yeah. You're too in your own world. But many people don't have that. So if they put Kanye West mindset. It's just normal life. Mm. The whole idea. unless you embody it the whole entire time. Yeah, you know. If you do it like sometimes inconsistent, it's, yeah, yeah, inconsistent, mm. then it's like, who are you? <laughs> <laughs> This doesn't make sense. Yeah. But yeah, what who's who's yours as name? I can't hmm. think of any right I now. I asked you this question before, sir. <laughs> I forget. You, you who, got, who did he say? I forget, sir. Who 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 did he say? Who? I don't know who. Zefron. Ah, huh, Zefron. 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 I used to like him. Used to used what? To, my my crush. Oh. High school musical, my, my high school musical high school. crush. <laughs> ever, ever since his jaw. What happened to his jaw, sir? Yeah? Fall down the stairs. I think he fell. Right? Is, is it really? I think there's a cover up, no? Yeah. <laughs> I I'm I'm just gonna close my eyes. He fell. <laughs> <laughs> But my one, I would say Kanye and Conor. Conor McGregor. Conor McGregor. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Both like egoistic people, eh? Doesn't matter. <laughs> I, I I I. But Conor, like from like he also had yeah. quite a journey. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Like yeah. people, all Historic. of them like started from nothing, you know. Like mm-hmm. yeah. they really believe in themselves. You know? mm. Like the way they say, right? And it happened. That one really for me, like wow, them. Yeah. That like, confidence, ah. Uh, yeah. Them, son. Yeah. <laughs> cool. And I think also after watching his documentary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was also very. I haven't watched it that. though. You should watch it. It's on Netflix. How Kay. long is it? Okay, last last question. Okay. Three episodes. Oh, okay. Last question. Okay. Uh, what is your biggest challenge in your career, like your mm. music career and modeling career? What is the biggest? Challenge? The biggest challenge is not being so hard on myself. Yeah, I'm my biggest critique. Mm-hmm. I would say, no mm-hmm. matter what I'm doing, I'm always the one that's saying like, no, no, this, that. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So my biggest challenge is o- always overcoming my own mind mm-hmm. and wow. just kind of like having that mindset of confidence of mm-hmm. being like, no, you can do this. Mm-hmm. Just embody it, yeah. and everybody will think every everything's fine. Yeah. <laughs> so. So just channel it, yeah, you yeah, know, yeah. when it comes. But also, also to always be myself mm-hmm. and stay true to myself and what I want to do and what 
I believe in. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I feel like when when you when people be themselves, right? People know that you are being yourself. You know. You can feel it. Yeah. I feel also. Yeah. People like no, okay, this this person is be, being themselves. They're not trying to be fake. You know. Mm. Yeah. But sometimes if you be fake, it helps you be confident, though. Sometimes, yeah. But you you can be confident without being fake, right? Yeah, yeah. Like, because I, I heard like uh, fake it till you make it. Not ah. somehow, but it's like you act confident to be confident. Oh, same like you now faking it till no. you make it. <laughs> <laughs> It works though. No, but if you believe, if you believe in it, mm-hmm. you might just get yourself there because of yeah. that. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. yeah. See, so it's like so. It depends it. on individual. I mean, yeah. okay, I feel like if you want to be fake, right, you got to be proper fake. What do you mean? What do you? Yeah. What? Yeah. The, what, <laughs> like, what does that proper mean? Proper fake must like properly be fake, ah. Uh. You know, like I mean? in a no. nice way. In a nice way, ah. Uh. But uh. like, or like there's a limit to it, is it? Mm, like you don't, you don't, you don't like people see you like this guy being fake. Just don't cringe, yeah. No, no, uh, <laughs> don't cringe. But what if, right? Don't get caught that you are being fake. Something like that. You <laughs> know what I mean? How it. how do you get caught being fake if you you're fake? No, be, because <laughs> like uh, people see you lying, maybe. Oh, like, I know, I know. It's like you are being fake, but <laughs> trying to manipulate people to think that you are being real, but actually mm-hmm. people can see, hey, this is fake. Mm-hmm. I so love like how that. we're just like <laughs> <laughs> have to be fake. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, the topic right yeah. now. <laughs> but how do we be fake though? Like if you if you be fake, right? People will say, hey, you. I can see that you are faking it, like I I don't want to support you or something like that, right? Ah. Mm. But then if you are faking it and and you make it, means people don't really know that you are faking it. So if you want to so fake, fake it and lie, fake it and lie, until, <laughs> fake it and lie and make it. No, I think. <laughs> wow, wow. <laughs> it is that, that, that's good. <laughs> fake it and lie and make it. No, I think you can fake it only if you make it. What? You but you only... need to fake it to make it. Yeah. yeah. So if you fake it, make sure you make it. Oh, okay, 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 okay. <laughs> <Makes sense. laughs> Let's do it. But what if we fake it like in purpose? Like it's obvious mm. because like this is a character of mine. That one is like, troll, troll, troll lady, yeah. that one. What? Troll lah. Yeah. Ah, troll, is it? Yeah, that one is troll. That if people also... know that you're trolling, then it's fine. Yeah. But are we talking about fake it in a career or whole life? Uh, Cur- career. I uh. Career. Like career. I feel career. Career. To me, it's like whole life. Eh. Whole, huh? whole life. Huh? Wah, yeah. say. To grow, to grow. So if like let's but say, but then I'm what a, if it's not you? Yeah. Okay, yeah. let's say if I'm. When a, you go back home, you still want to fake it. Who <laughs> fake it to who? No, like, to the mirror. <laughs> yeah, just don't tell the truth, ah, uh, fake. You get know what I mean? Exhausting, ah. Uh. No lah. <laughs> too damn exhausting. <laughs> like, let's say if I'm an introvert, then I want to. I need to talk to people. Like. Uh, I have well, to. That would be it. fucking exhausting. Girl. Yeah, you no, must try. Then, so so I'm. I used to be quite an. In- I'm an mm. introvert actually. I'm really, a mix. man. Yeah, <laughs> but my work made me mm. become an extrovert, so I'm a bit of both. Oh yeah. Yeah, so it's like when I'm working, okay, I channel my extrovertness. Mm-hmm. Yeah, <laughs> but then people that like know me. But don't you feel tired when you go back home? Like, ah, oh, the battery. No, yeah, the because battery. I learn. Yeah. Like it, it kind of like teaches me. Okay. Um, what is too much what is too little in a sense how much do I want to share mm-hmm. how much am I comfortable with things like that yeah, yeah. Slim. learn from Iman yeah. <laughs> it's hard yeah, really. it's like you, the more you, you talk it. to people the more confident you get yeah. in a sense yeah. it's just like how you doing this podcast yeah. Yeah, yeah. in the first time but this one is like my comfort like zone there's nobody yeah. here it's less but everybody's my watching <laughs> but they're not here no that physically. thing is like you need to step out of your comfort zone and then slowly you will adapt one. Slowly yeah. you will learn and adapt lah. No, you step out you know? so the comfort zone gets bigger. Why mm. suddenly about me, Sia? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> step out of the comfort zone so the comfort zone gets bigger. She agree already. Validated. We go to Batu. Yeah, we go to Batu. Thank you very much for listening or watching guys and if you guys want to follow us or subscribe to our YouTube channel, it's called Wello. And we see you guys after this. Peace. <laughs> Mara Mara, please, eh? Eh, where go, I Mara Mara every time. You sure? I'm sure, I'm sure. Okay, Acha, tamu ke laut, Acha. Eh, Acha, aku tengah jalan ke laut, tunggu aku. If you're trying to see what's up, hit up well up for the vibe. Running from behind the scene, you can see it with your eyes. Raise goons, making chest moves, this mean I's down the right. Better turn your shit up, everything gon' be alright. Hey, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the one and only Wello Show. Mm. Yeah, do follow us on Spotify, it's at Wello. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we still join with Iman Fandi. Yeah, let's, let's go. go. Let's go. Okay, just now we asked you about the best fan experience, right? Mm-hmm. What about the worst fan experience? Ooh. Or weird, no. weirdest, or whatever lah. Uh, I think a weird, weird one lah. Weird. Okay, honestly, I actually haven't had a weird one, mm. but 
I guess the closest to it was that like somebody was just following me mm-hmm. while I was walking around town and stuff like that. Oh, yeah. Mm-hmm. What is it? And uh, yeah, so that would be the weird thing. It's Nothing creepy. much happened. It was just like I was sensing somebody like, mm. you know, <laughs> yeah, the yeah, pictures yeah. and stuff. Yeah, yeah. So yeah. Just I run away from the guy. Like. Cannot run. Right? You cannot know? run. Run a bit obvious, right? Yeah. But well, last time you were running what? Uh, oh, so, so I'm practicing. I'm practicing in Orchard Road. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Yeah. But this kind of weird people, I don't understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Papa? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why? You don't understand. Like, yeah, why, why the why fuck would they do, they do yeah. that? Maybe they're shy to ask, mm. so they just follow you around. Yeah. But it's weird. Creepy, they don't actually. Know. Yeah. Mm. Kind of creepy. Weird. Yeah. <laughs> what? Well, uh, uh, yeah, lah. Okay. Yeah. Keep it, actually. Yeah. <laughs> but I mean, most of the time, This is like something that I think uh, when I go out more with family, it happens is mm. when we have dinner. It's mm-hmm. not weird or anything. Mm-hmm. When we have dinner and people just like tap me on the shoulder. and or just tap like, you. Yeah. And then ask for pictures. Mm-hmm. And then, yeah. Did it, did oh, oh, oh now I know. Now I know one like, it's not weird also. It's just like, I didn't appreciate it. Annoying. When I first came back to Singapore, I think not a lot of people... Um, knew i was half south african mm. or i don't know i don't know but i had i had curly hair mm-hmm. so people t- just touch my hair without me well, asking have, this one you reborn actually no 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 it's just if i put water it'll curl back up oh yeah. Okay. Yeah, like now i dip in water <laughs> <laughs> sound effect you try huh? Can I, can yeah, I slap? so they'll just touch my hair without me asking. Yeah, oh, so I don't appreciate that, mm. but like it, it's happened. Before. Oh, yeah. yeah. But obviously, have weird DMs lah. DMs. Of weird course, DMs. Right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I guess so. Everybody gets weird DMs. Do you read your DMs? Yeah. Every single DM. Uh, I see them, mm. but I don't respond to like, I don't entertain the negatives one. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Do you guys? What do you guys do with your DMs? Uh, I'm so excited when he get DM. No, huh? He excited. <laughs> no. I sometimes I like to disturb back. What do you mean? Wait, 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 pause, pause. What do you mean by I'm so excited to get That's DMs? That's why. Like, get DMs. Oh, because he's he don't always get DMs lah. Ah, oh, okay, okay, I understand. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> But what do you do Eagle, if you get weird DMs? I just ignore. Simple. Just ignore. No. But if it's like a fan like thanking you or like oh. saying like, hi. Hmm. I will... D- reply. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> it sounds like a lie. The one I will, I will reply. Yeah. I will reply there. I will ask them to refer to Wello account. Hmm. Huh? Yeah. Please follow. Yeah. Like that. No, I will say compliment Wello, not me. Oh. Huh? Yeah. What nonsense! Yeah. Stamble. I don't know because I get too much compliment. Ah. Uh, so wow. Kacau lah. <laughs> nonsense. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Nonsense. But, but anyway, right? Um. If we. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's okay, like, it's okay. like you performing, you sometimes you perform and all. Mm-hmm. Right? Mm. Do you have this anxiety or you just like natural? Like? No, I get I get anxious, mm. and I try if I can to like prep myself two mm. weeks ahead, you know. But sometimes performances or, um, you know, just stuff that are quite important, no matter what it is, can just turn up the next day mm. or two days later. But mm. f- performance wise. I try to prep myself. I do get anxiety as much as I prep myself. Also, sometimes when you get on the stage mm-hmm. and you see the people, your my heart just goes bum 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 bum. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, and when you cannot control that, that's when you start getting shaky and yeah. just jittery and mm-hmm. scared. But I realize that if I have my friends there and I just look at them and I have fun with them and make eye contact, then mm-hmm. I'm like calm. So I think mm-hmm. it's also having the right people around mm-hmm. and. If the crowd is not moving, just just pretend you're like a, you know, a diva or something. <laughs> just like, oh yeah, I'm in my own world. Just yeah, like yeah, yeah. enjoy yourself. Yeah. Do you have like a ritual before you? Go a on ritual. Stage? Yeah. Just like vocal like, vocal exercises. Oh, don't have yeah. like that. You know, like, like when, the brr, brr, uh, ah. yeah, like that. Don't have. Uh. I don't, uh, I jump a lot. Oh, is it? I jump. Yeah, I jump. Does it, does I it help? A little bit. Because I heard like me, yeah. singers sometimes they do push ups backstage. Oh, I've never done that before. Uh, maybe you should try. Uh. I shall. <laughs> I shall. When you say spiritual, I, I immediately think of ritual like some... Huh? Spiritual. Ritual. <laughs> ritual. Ritual. When, ritual. You, when you say ritual, I immediately think of like some Demagic demonic stuff. Uh. Damn, son. Why? How come, yeah. you think, how come you think straight to that? That's why. I don't know. Because most of the time, like performers... You're very narrow-minded. That's why. <laughs> no, because a lot of like this 
celebrities like artists Beyonce or whatever mm. they keep they they say that they will do ritual before they they start performing and everything. You Is this like it? the the triangle thing? What's it called? Illuminati. Illuminati. Uh-huh. Is it? Are you inside the Illuminati? <laughs> Are you? <laughs> Scared. <laughs> Are you? <laughs> Are we? <laughs> But yeah, they they always like say that they do ritual. Right? They, they say that, or who? people assume that they do. Yeah, uh, people assume lah. Uh. I think Beyonce got say before, right? Really? She said that she closed her eyes. Now, right? Pause, maybe, pause, she pause, 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 maybe she just prays. Yeah. Now, right? Hey, why are you talking bad on Iman Spandi, favorite singer, right? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 <laughs> Now she's protecting, you know. <laughs> no, but you know, not that that video that she said that she before she performed, right? She would close her eyes and then she would say something, and then she would feel like something take over her body or something. Who is it? Take which is, over. Which is, uh, I think she's well, referring. Very defensive, <laughs> Iman. <laughs> No, no. She's referring to her, her what? What is it? Let Alter know. ego. Alter ego. Is it? Ah. The Shasha what? Shasha Grey. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, her, what's no, her no, alter no. ego name? I don't have an alter ego no, name. No, her, her Beyonce. I don't know. What is it? Queen B. I don't know. Queen B. Yeah. Maybe Shasha it's fierce more like. Oh, Shasha. oh is it the no. fierce thing? Ah. <laughs> no, who? Who is that? <laughs> <laughs> I I forget lah, but she has she have a alter ego. Then she said that the alter ego will take over her body, and then when she perform, right, like, that's when she get crazy. Ah, oh. it's just an act, lah. Yeah. Like oh, maybe a, yeah, maybe it's like her act. Yeah, yeah. Her, yeah. When she, cause when she does perform, Mm-mm. it is quite different to how her personality yeah, yeah, yeah. is mm-hmm. on the day to day. Wow, we're talking like we know her, like yeah. we're best friends. Yeah. Best friend forever. <laughs> <laughs> no, the, the, forever. The, the, <laughs> There's one time where she performed with Jay Z, and then she just kneel on the floor, and then she just put her hand on the floor, and then she just like you know, that one is like hair. with her hair. She just whip her hair like oh, that. Oh, that's wow. the that maybe that's part of the performance. That one, no, definitely not part of the performance. <laughs> it's like a demonic thing. Uh. That one is like I think she's just like I don't know. I, no, no, I think into it. Yeah, into it. But intuit now already. she's just um started her tour, yeah. her tour, yeah, and tour. her daughter is like dancing and yeah, stuff yeah, with yeah, her. Oh, so, I watched the so cute. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> It's cool. Yeah. Her, dance, her daughter that dance with her. Mm. Yeah. Would you bring your mom to dance with you in stage? <laughs> My mom. <Yeah. laughs> <laughs> Would you? <laughs> She can watch. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, like on stage. If I bring her, then I bring other people. Oh, also. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Unless it's Mother's Day. Oh, then yeah. Maybe. It, makes, it makes more sense. <laughs> okay, who are the three people that you want to work with in the future? Um, Zara Larson. Mm. Okay. Okay, this is like dream big kind yeah, of yeah, yeah. yeah. Mm. Zara Larson, um, The Weeknd, mm. and Rihanna. Oh, Rihanna. Yeah, my but, top, my top like artist. But Ooh. be careful with the The Weeknd. Uh. Why? Yeah. You watch the Idol. That's why yeah. is it? You cannot yeah. behave. Uh. <laughs> 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 hey, but the The Weeknd say he's not gonna be The Weeknd anymore. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, is yeah. he changing? Yes. He's like the weekend's like no more. Really. This, so I he's just gonna be able. able I yes. think so. His real name that like it's him lah. You want to show yeah. his true mm. self? Oh, see, maybe it's that like yeah. the weekend is his persona, yeah. mm. and then able is now he wants to share yeah. his real self. Mm. Yeah, the fake it part wants to go away. Yeah, mm. right. Yep. <laughs> Does he really want to go away though? Because weekend is like too good already. Huh? Should it go away? The weekend. If the song, I mean, if the sound of him changes, mm. then we'll really see like a shift. Yeah. Yeah, of like the different personality and stuff. Do you want it to go away? No. Hmm. I, well, I feel like people stay. will still call him the weekend uh, instead True. of yeah. Abel, right? Abel or Abel? Abel. 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 That's why. You got a weird last name. Uh? He. <laughs> Where is he from? Uh? I don't know. Where is he from, man? <laughs> Canada. <laughs> Huh? No lah, like the, in the how the hell we, I know African I'm country. Ethiopia, Ethiopia, I think. If Beyonce, I can answer lah. Beyonce, Where? best Where? forever. Houston, <laughs> Houston, Texas. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I want to ask you: sh- Should you prioritize your your relationship and everything like for your career? Ooh. Mm. Wow, I keep saying oof because <laughs> your questions are really good. Um, <laughs> prioritize your relationship over your career. Yeah. Is that I think balance. Balance, or if you want to, like, have a career, do it now, mm. and then when you have time to focus on your relationship, mm. then you know, do that after or mm. something. But I feel for me personally, if I really want something, I'll make it work. 
mm -hmm. matter what. Even if I'm traveling or, you know, busy, I can take a five minute call. I can, and if we can't call, I'll give you a voice note. I'll mm -hmm. text you like, Hey, mm -hmm. been busy about thinking about you. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like, I think it's the little, little things that, that matter the most. Yeah. Yeah. And then if two people are trying to make it work and mm -hmm. keep trying every day, even if there's ups and downs, as long as you know that you're committed into making it work, I think that is fine. Mm. Yeah. And don't compromise like, you know, your work or your relationship. Just see how you can manage it. Mm -hmm. Do you ever have difficulty with that? No. Uh, I actually recently did. Oh. Mm. But, but I mean, for me, I can manage it. Mm -hmm. But I think some people can't. Mm -hmm. So I just have to... Let it go and see what happens. Do you mm -hmm. like the idea of dating through your career? You know what I mean? It's like you oh, date like, someone famous or so. So, I don't know. Because I've... In Singapore? <laughs> uh, doesn't matter. As long as the guy is famous. I think it's okay. But you never mm. know if the two careers or the two mm. person personalities will clash. Oh, yeah. Yeah. For me, I'm just chill. <laughs> like, for <laughs> me, I'm, I'm honestly okay with... If you work in the industry, outside of the industry, mm. but I know a lot of people that actually say working, I mean, dating somebody who is outside of the industry is mm. better. Mm. Yeah. What do you guys think? I think it's better. Is it? Just yeah. so you don't have like the same. Yeah. Why do? Yeah. Why do? It, it will be boring also at the same time. Right? You know? What do you mean? But at the same time also, you can understand the, 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 the other person, the, the, your partner. Oh. But at the same time also, I feel like it's better to like try something new. Like, wait, wait. Mm. Why you say it's boring? It's right. What is boring about it? Okay, let's say well, your <laughs> let's say your girlfriend is all, an wow, actor. Damn, so all <laughs> <looking>. <laughs> let's say your your girlfriend is an actor. Okay. Mm. So how is it boring? No, actor and not that if but I if I'm same, acting like it's the same industry like media industry and all oh, like yeah, you are out yeah. there what with her la, you know both is like out there like mm -hmm. famous like in a way. Mm -hmm. So why is it boring? Uh, no, for me is singer and a singer is kind of like boring. But, but then you can make music together. Yeah, yeah, that's the thing. But she also can make music about me when we break up. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But then you can make music about her. Wait, Why? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> like the weekend. Uh. The make song about Bella okay. Hadid. All. Oh. Somehow. But it's more like people know who that person is. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So yeah. the mm. drama is like maybe more sometimes, publicized. Sometimes it's good because like a lot of people go through like breakups yeah. and all that. So mm. it's like kind of relatable. So when mm. people listen like, hey, this is me before. You can what? understand. Yeah, you can yeah. understand. You know? But mm. then also dating someone outside, then you get a different perspective. Yeah. So it can work both ways. Yeah, yeah it's, right. it's whether or not like your personality cl clash. Yeah. If the other person is too like egotistic, I guess, and you you don't vibe with that, mm. then yeah, it can, you know, yeah. make things harder. Yeah. I don't know or if it. you guys are kind of challenging one another of like one upping oh. each other like oh, yeah. oh i'm going to this event yeah, yeah, yeah are you yeah. going uh, or you'll be my plus one and mm -hmm. then you're like oh, I'm, i'm not going you, things like that yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah but what if when it comes to like award shows like you know jay-z and beyonce i think mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. during the grammys back then uh, yeah why then do you get do you do will you feel like jealous or will you feel like jealous let your significant other win lah but it's a different in this category, category. Right? yeah Because female Don't and male is different. No, no. Some like, let's say album, uh, best uh, album. Uh, like, like that kind of thing. Yeah. Like, would you feel like, oh, okay, you go. Obviously, support the challenge. Or low-key like yeah, jealous. Yeah. Uh, low-key like jealous. Uh, They want toxic, yeah. Yeah, Slim. Yeah, so uh, Slim. No, but no, then no, no, if I'm they're your asking. partner, you'll be even more proud. Because yeah. mm -hmm. you're like, oh yeah, that's my man. Yeah. Oh, that's my girl. Yeah. I'll be proud. I think. <laughs> if mine <laughs> didn't work, it's okay. Yeah. Next time. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> support each other. You know? Mm. Hmm. I think it's like eye-opening and can be quite inspiring also to see your partner succeed yeah, and then yeah. vice versa. Yeah. Like everybody has their, you know, wins and losses. And it's good yeah. publicity also. <laughs> mm. They the one you care about. Uh. <laughs> they want also is part of it. <laughs> publicity. They want low-key toxic because people no, like, will you just date for it for the sake of it. Or oh, there's oh, people yeah. does that like, actually. Right. Yeah. Oh, like the, the team... Puts two people together oh. just ah. for media, is it? Ah, yes. Yeah, yeah. Mm. Who? Uh, who? I think Kim Kardashian, right? They're not Kim Kardashian. The Kardashian family do that the best. Huh? Is it? Yeah. I feel like they, they do that the best. But do you think that right, when they do that, right? 
Do you think like the guys know about it or the guys like genuinely love? Obviously, them? the guys also know. The guys, the guys know. Because yeah. yeah. they'll be on the show, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. They get paid okay. and get all the benefits from the family. Yeah, they get more famous, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Maybe you should date a Kardashian <laughs> or Jenner. Yeah. Damn. Think about it. Uh. Can the Jenner <laughs> now be bad bunny? Oh yeah, you watch, you are, watch they, the, are they still together? Yeah, they stay together. Hey, you watch the um basketball the clips? Oh, they go to the NBA games. Oh yeah, I saw that. They, they were the talking, picture. Yeah, it's a video. Oh. On TikTok, then Bad Bunny was like talking to Kendall Jenner, but Kendall Jenner talking to the friend. Yeah, like lazy on to lion. Her body language, ah, uh, yeah, you should know all about it, lah. Yeah, yeah. I saw, I saw. <laughs> but then it's like maybe they don't want to, you know. They don't want to show that they much. They want to uh, show yeah, yeah, yeah. to to PDA or mm, something like that. Yeah, yeah. See, but. Like the whole world know that they are dating, yeah. Or maybe I don't know. Or maybe people just overreacting. Maybe. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's be, uh, like very possible. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe she just. Maybe people just took that clip, but mm. there were other clips. Yeah. yeah. By the way, there were other clips also when they are walking off. Oh. oh she walks first. Yes. Then like, you know right? You saw the clip, yeah, right? Yeah, but like, Justin Bieber. She always that? walks first. That's why, right. like Justin Bieber also do that with with the wife. Yeah. Haley. Yeah. But how would you feel? Let's say you're married or uh, you have a boyfriend. I <laughs> 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 or you have a girlfriend. Yeah. Or you have a, you know, a partner and mm-hmm. they just always go first. I'll feel like, oh, yeah. hold my hand. Yeah, 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 yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> how are you so fast? What are you yeah. rushing for? <laughs> Pull her. Yeah. <laughs> Calm down. Maybe that's what she want. Huh? <laughs> or maybe that's, yeah, that's, maybe what, that's what she want. want. Right, Iman? What? <laughs> like, for me to pull her back. <laughs> <laughs> But if she's walking forward, why would you? I pull her back. That's what I mean. Like to walk with me. Why are you walking so fast? I just pull her. Uh, maybe. Could it be? I don't know. <laughs> what the hell? Psychology, so I ask you lah. <laughs> but maybe if she's walking forward hmm. in front, she's asking you catch up. That one is too fat, <laughs> eh? too slow. Actually, can they do them tall, sir? That's why. Uh. She always walk fast. Her fast. legs. Yeah. Oh, long legs. Uh. Long legs. What the hell? <laughs> maybe. Okay, do, you, do you make love songs? Mm-hmm. You make love songs as well. Wait, what do you mean? Love like songs. Love songs, huh? Like about relationships. Uh, yeah, yeah. Relationships. Then, uh, how do you know that you are in love? Hmm. Okay, so I feel that. Well, this is a good question. I want to know, sir. Mm-hmm. I right. feel like in each relationship that you're in, you always learn a different kind of love. Mm. You know, like your first love is your first love. Mm. You think it's love. Mm-hmm. But then when you meet the next person, you're like, oh no, how come this person is loving me in a different way? Mm-hmm. And it feels more genuine, let's mm-hmm. say. And then you kind of get a hint of what you like and what you don't like and what you need to mm. be loved. Mm. So for me, I know that I'm loved if my needs are being met. Mm-hmm. So like for me is, uh, you know, love language, like uh, whether it's physical physical touch or so words says, of yeah. affirmation, things like that. Mm-hmm. So if that person can love me in the way that I need, mm-hmm. I will feel the love. Mm-hmm. But imagine if I love you by giving you gifts, but you don't need gifts because you have everything. Mm-hmm. And then you're just like, I want to hear more. I miss you. Mm-hmm. Or you want to hear more like, oh, thinking about you, but mm-hmm. I don't give you that. Then mm-hmm. you won't feel love. What? Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I think that's how I know that I'm loved. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And I mean, for me, also quite simple. It's just like, I want you to love me, care for me, mm. miss me, respect me. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Things, yeah, things like that. Mm-hmm. And I think the most important is also effort. Yeah. I want to see you at least trying. If it's a long distance, because two of my past relationships were actually long distance. Mm-hmm. If you're trying to connect, if you're trying to create ideas of mm. like, okay, this is how we can talk, this is how we can play games, or mm-hmm. this is how we can meet, mm. then I can feel the love from that also. Yeah. Mm. But that's why you, you, you talk about like um wait 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 <laughs> you talk about you got to say this word um, you almost had it you almost had it wait 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 uh, come on Aslam come on Aslam is it a uh, love no um, come on Aslam is it word? initiative or oh, effort oh, yes right. effort yeah okay you said effort right mm-hmm. so <laughs> because normally like, do, during talking stage right it's like you kind of don't want to put in so much effort because you don't want to show it like it's a one way thing this then is it's like, like how thing, uh? <laughs> what? This, is, this is like the thing people always think it's like oh no you don't want to show that you're too keen mm. right yeah, yeah, yeah. things like that basically but, pay hard to get lah. Uh, yeah you mm. have to like you know push and pull lah. but, but at the not same time, too much also not mm. too much yeah where so do we draw the line huh where do we draw the line <laughs> yeah sometimes <laughs> like if i put this let's say i put in effort in this particular moment or mm-hmm. like weeks or what right but i don't get the same energy right yeah that's yeah, when that's, I, mm. that, that's when i will feel like ah oh, fuck man like 
does she really like me or like am I doing too much yeah. or like that's well, that is I, on her because you're asking for a friend now, or yourself <laughs> no this is just like <laughs> <laughs> just no. like ex- life experience uh. um well I feel like if you put in the effort don't you feel like that also yeah I, I felt like that where I've put in a lot of effort and I'm like how come I'm not getting that back or mm-hmm. how come I'm not getting the same mm-hmm. effort or yeah. feeling back but then all I can do is to control what I'm doing mm. and if I've put in the effort to show you that I like you or that I care for you or love you, then it's up to the other person to send that back, mm-hmm. you know? Yeah. So sometimes some people might, you know, understand and be like, oh, okay, this is his signal or her signal. Mm-hmm. But some people, maybe they just don't like you in that way. Or maybe it takes time. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Mm. And that is when the talking stage feel uh, boring. Uh. Mm. I mean, if you keep trying and you're getting nothing back, then you kind of get your answer, yeah. I feel. But yeah. it is not just about me. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it is, it is <laughs> like, about you. It's like about me. Really like, uh. <laughs> yeah, no, but no. I mean, we we can all kind of like read signals also. Yeah, yeah. We, yeah. Can, we can tell when somebody's yeah. not really mm, into it, mm. things like that. But sometimes like, they just don't know how to... Let's say, okay, let's say this girl, right? Mm. I put in so much effort, right? Mm-hmm. She like me, you know, uh-huh. but it's just like she don't know how to put in that effort. Is she shy? Yeah, kind of uh, like that. So I think like so sometimes pause, pause, pause. Uh, like, uh, I, I can start the day. Boring. <laughs> I, mean, <laughs> I think there's no such thing as she don't know. No, if she oh, really like oh, wait, pause, <laughs> pause, pause, pause. I, I don't know. Sometimes, sometimes I feel like if you really like no. the guy, like, you will. It's not about don't know. So the I guy wanna, will. You're not listening, yeah. girl. It's not about don't yeah, know. Yeah, she, don't she fight, don't fight. No, she knows. It's just that she don't know how to put in that effort. Like she don't know how to, in a way, to show love, lah. Cap. Really? Cap. Slowly, slowly, maybe like, okay, meet her. Uh, actually, you got to jaga, like, like jaga. Just, like just when you say take time, right? But... <laughs> Too much time already. Uh, <laughs> then, maybe you back off a bit and see if she comes back. But if you, if you really like that, some, if you really like that person, right? Mm-hmm. Confirm you will like show that you like that person. But sometimes you don't know if you like the person unless you meet them. Unless okay. you met them already. If you haven't met, they're all different. Mm. I mean, if you meet already, you still don't want to like show... It's not the one I could. It's less. Don't it's know just, how. Uh, don't know how. Because, f- okay, so for me, right, I, I've been on dates where I don't know. I kind of like the guy, but mm. I didn't know if he liked me or not. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And then I thought, mm-hmm. oh, okay, mm-hmm. this is a friend ah, date. Okay, okay. But then I found out he actually did like me. Mm. Okay, okay. And we didn't talk for like years. And mm-hmm. then we rekindled and he actually became my boyfriend. Mm. So that years in between was my immaturity, I mm. guess, would say also. Because I was younger and I also didn't know myself. So maybe some people takes like a bit longer for them to understand what they like. Are they shy? Mm-hmm. Things like that. So yeah, because I cannot read signals sometimes. I'm yeah. like at a date and think, oh yeah, bro. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, bro. Bro zone. Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> so things like that. But that's why you say um, you thought like this is like a friendly, right? Like what makes you think that that is a friend date. Like, what did he do that you think like, okay, this one confirmed like friend date. Like, it's not like really like... It's the guy's know. fault. The guys never take charge. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Mm. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's kind of true. Right? Yeah. Wait, pause. The guy but also sometimes him. guys don't want to take too much charge because mm. then it can make the girl feel like, whoa. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Don't want right? to overdo You're it. You're making it difficult, mm. yeah. I'm so confused right now. <laughs> <laughs> it's complicated. Yeah, okay, really. so I guess do what you can mm-hmm. to show that you like somebody. But if that other person doesn't send it back, Give them time. And if the time is too much for you, then that's when you know mm-hmm. to back off, I guess. Because mm-hmm. you can only control what you do and yeah. what yeah. you show. Yeah. Yeah. And if, if you want to be direct, go direct. Damn. Do you like me or not? Do you like me or not? <laughs> and actually, don't, don't, don't. Yes don't. or no? Don't, 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 don't. It's a bit much, actually. Yeah, 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 don't, yeah, don't, don't, don't do it. Don't do it. No. <laughs> okay, do, you, do you think like guys or, guy, guys or girls like, should love more? You should love equally. equally. But I've seen that they said, find a guy that loves you more. Mm-hmm. I've seen like things like that mm-hmm. because they, people think that if a guy loves you more, mm-hmm. then they will show more effort mm-hmm. because apparently it takes guys more training. Training? Okay, I understand. <laughs> In a sense where like to get used to the girl and mm-hmm. stuff like that. Yeah. So, so you think it's equal? I think it should be equal. Aslam think the girls should love the guy more than the guy. I still think it's him. Everybody <laughs> thinks like it's one or the other. Yeah. But I think it's equal. Hmm. Why do you think well, it's the uh, is girls should so love I'm the guy? waiting for you to ask them why. Then. <laughs> you want her to ask me why? Yeah. Okay, let me give you a... Actually, I forgot that I see that. Uh. 
Cheers. Here we go again. Here we go again. Act blue, live longer. Act blue, live longer. No, to me, to me, the girl should love the guy more because the guy put in so much effort to get the girl. But there are some guys that don't put in that much effort. Like what? Just some guys. Yeah. Which which guy? I think I, I think what she's saying is when they are in a relationship already, right? Mm-mm. In a relationship, people get like comfortable. Uh, mm. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You're saying is in the beginning, right? Actually, in general, uh, But in if general. you love somebody, you should be in a relationship with them already, right? Mm-hmm. Mm. Uh. Uh, this this thing, the question it doesn't mean the guy is not loving the girl though. Mm-hmm. The guy loves the girl, but the girl is supposed to love the guy more. So that she be- can put more effort. No, because she will be. I don't know to say, but it's like neutralize the feelings. You know what I mean? Because uh, because you love the girl already so because much. Because if I love the girl too much, right, the girl will automatically leave. Oh damn ah. son! Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <Damn> son. Whoa. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that's why? what I feel. Why? Why? Have why? you had that experience? Yeah, it's like that's how you say like that's why people who the guys who love the girl too mm-hmm. much, right? The girl will just why is this guy like? Maybe you get, you the I mean? girl doesn't know a right a a good guy cannot tell that oh you're Maybe. a good guy. But it's in the uh, automatic. Uh, feelings of like it's situation. like the ick is it yeah it's like why is this guy like is this, is this even a man you get what I mean uh, yeah you but, get what I mean okay clingy is also different yeah clingy and like overdoing it is different compared yeah. to passionate and mm. loving and caring and respectful mm. yeah yeah but I still stand with my answer <laughs> okay <laughs> <laughs> I think we ran out of yeah. time uh, okay okay uh, Uh, I want to ask you this question. You have a special, a sp- special, special, eh? special, <laughs> special, special, special talent. Speaking without, uh, speaking without actually speaking. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. How can you forget about that? You, you can do it. Hmm. I have my own talent, but I don't know if you can understand though. Uh, I haven't I'm done try, it in so try, long. Try. That's why you say hello, is it? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> huh? Cannot write. Cannot, cannot. understand. <laughs> <laughs> What was it? I hello. said hi, guys. How are you doing? No, I, I used I heard to be hello. better at it. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, it's mm. like the puppet thing, mm. right? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> so, so bad right now. <laughs> I haven't practiced. Yeah. Can I read about it? Read about it. Yeah. Can. Thank on. you very much, uh, Iman Fandi, for joining us. Yeah. Thank you for having it. me. <laughs> and thank you very much for watching. And if you guys want to follow us on Instagram or subscribe to our YouTube channel, it's called Wello. Mm-hmm. And lastly, you want to shout out your socials? Yes. Yeah, follow to me on camera. Instagram, YouTube, Everywhere, TikTok, Facebook, Twitter, <laughs> I'm I'm all over. And Spotify and Apple. All right, guys, check out her latest single. Top Peace. Up.